Looking very stylish. <laughs> right, so this morning, what happened now? I wake you up and going, Kah! Should we do it? Reenact there I was, happy asleep. And suddenly. <laughs> On the way to the train station. So we're on the train to London while we go, and it's not very nice weather, but I'm quite excited because we're gonna go to some other city tomorrow. Out the flat. Fun times. Um, this is a Tetris mug. There's not much else to say. We really. bought food. Oh yeah, we bought food for there were like the next few days. In the entire place, many, many, many. Things. There were actually five cups. So it's 5:34, <laughs> and we're already in our pajamas. I've had a shower. I'm so excited for summer in the city tomorrow. Uh, we made pasta and tuna sweet corn, which we're going to mix together later, Yay! and we're going to do a flat tour. What a surprise to find you behind the door! Let's <laughs> just pop right into the bathroom, shall we? There's a lovely dotty shower curtain uh, and a toilet, so that's really exciting. I can shop. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. And now we're in the well. What I, I don't know what to call it. A living bedroom. Living bedroom. That's my uh, camping pillow. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we're being really tidy, you know, just keeping our stuff down there. Here is the kitchen. This is all our food. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Jack the cakes in there. That's our pasta calling down. This is all so exciting. How exciting! That's the flat. And uh, there's the cheeky church house. So uh, <laughs> This is how successful our tuna sweet corn pasta was. Yeah, right, let's do a taste test. So now and I are playing a game called Twelve Men's Morris, uh, which may have heard the original uh, Nine Men's Morris. Morris. It's a classic medieval era game, <laughs> like pub game, right? They're just a little explanation of how Twelve Men's Morris. Right. Works. So whoever has silver goes first. The aim is to get three in a row. Because then you can remove one of the other player's counters. What the hell? Why? Oh, yeah, but I so I got three in a row, so I can now remove these. So once all the, the 12 counters are on the board, what happens is you have to move them to the next dot. Right, I'll show you. When one player only has three counters left, then they get to move them anywhere they want on the board. So they can um, literally just lift it up and fly it to another dot. As soon as they've got, like, lose one of those three counters, then they've lost. So the aim is to get the other person down to two counters or, or to stop them from being able to move completely by blocking them around all the sides. And I have one most of the time. Cause... Okay! <laughs> So I think I went off on a bit of a tangent there while we did uh, <laughs> explaining how 12 Men's Morris works. Yeah, had quite a good day. Yeah, most of it was just on the train, so see you tomorrow. Bye.